Hey guys, it's Patricia. So we are going over the scent of the month. I know it has been forever since you have seen one of these videos on my channel, but here we go. So I'm trying to kind of pick and choose which ones I want to get. I'm not sure if I want to jump all the way back and getting every um, scent of the month kit like I used to. Yes, yeah, so I'm trying to, I was trying to wait and see what I thought I would like because just in case I could not sell all of the bars, I wanted to have something that I knew I would personally enjoy warming through. So let's get to it. I'm just going to stick this over here. And um, I have like a zillion warmers. I just don't feel like doing the whole warmer of the month. So. I am doing the scent of the month. The scent of the month is for September. I cannot believe I am actually saying the word September is absolutely crazy. It literally seems like it was just February, like a couple of months ago. Like how crazy is this? So let's get into it. So this is called Boo Crew and that's the name of the warmer and the scent is called spooky but sweet so here we go warmer and the wax so as always you guys know i like to sniff things out before we just jump into it because i like to give you a true description of what i smell so you know now that the scent of the month is coming in pot with pods in it as well I like that because my son has started using pods more regularly. Um, this is actually uh, the pod that is going in his room right now, which is where I'm at. And I don't even know what this is he has going in here. Let me see. Oh, that I put in here for him. It is... Amazon Rain, I think that's what that, yep, Amazon Rain. I don't have my readers, oh, look, my nails match. I don't have my readers on, guys, so, and I did, well, the readers are across the room. But, yeah, we've got two pods of that going, and he has this going in his room, so he likes this one. So, I'm more, I don't even know. I have a sense to go, like the, the big one, the $50 one that changes colors, all that. Ask me where that's at. I don't even know where it is, guys. So, I have mainly been using these and just letting him have it because I know he is running the um, diffuser more now. So, once it runs out, then I'll just pop some more in for him and... You know, we can just do that. My husband has like the, is it the Go? Because I brought him the Go as well. He has his at school. But anyway, these are absolutely amazing. And let's see. Well, you know, you know what? We're going to sniff the wax first and then we're going to see how this smells. So we're getting these now in the scent of a month. So if you are a pod lover, then... You'll be very happy with that. So, these always sound so loud on camera. So, now we are getting um, two, let's see, that's three, seven packs of the wax, and then you are getting the pod. So, let's see how this smells, guys. So, this is spooky. But sweet. Let's see, y'all. Uh, it's kind of giving me, um, just from first sniff. Oh, what was it? It was another Halloween one. Give me candy. It's kind of giving me that. And, you know, I've watched one or two videos. Most of the time, I try not to do that. But this time I did. And I did hear people saying that if you liked Give Me Candy, you would enjoy this one. Yeah. It's kind of a spicier version of Give Me Candy. Not bad. 
it's not really giving the foodie vibes and y'all already know i i am not the person that wants my house smelling like food all the time it has spice but it's not too much spice i think i'm really gonna enjoy this i'm gonna have to put this one on today and see how i like it so let's go over the notes and see what scent he says and of course we still get the scent scented strips as well so these are the notes once again it looks like it is a three note bar and i appreciate that okay so the top is caramelized vanilla sugar the mid is smoked maple syrup i'm trying to do this without, without my readers y'all that's why it's taking a minute i can read and the base is nutmeg so that's where that spicy is coming in at so we've got caramelized vanilla sugar we've got smoked maple syrup and then we've got the nutmeg so the only note that really scared me in this coming in knowing the notes or you know when we ordered the kit knowing what the notes were going to be was the um smoked maple syrup because maple syrup can be like the best thing ever or it can go horribly wrong if you know you know you know a lot of maple syrup can really turn people off so i was kind of like oh i don't know but then i'm like okay vanilla sugar and nutmeg like that's got to balance it out to make a beautiful combination so i thought that those two notes would kind of outweigh or kind of tone down that maple syrup note enough where it was worth the chance of me buying it and being like okay this i think it's gonna work so for me it is working i like i said i do enjoy this what did i do with it um I was not a, the biggest Gimme Candy fan. Gimme Candy was just like, okay for me. It was very sweet. It was very, um, just kind of like pow in your face sweet. And this has just enough spice in it where it's really balancing everything out. It is a well-balanced bar. And I like that. I don't need my house to smell cloyingly sweet. I think this is going to be really, really good. So I am, I'm impressed. So let's see how the pod smells in comparison. Cause y'all know sometimes it can smell very different. So let's see. Now on the pods, I think I'm getting a little bit more spice. Yeah. The pods don't smell quite as sweet as the bar. I'm getting more spice in this wow that is a big difference let me smell hmm that is very odd and i've heard a lot of people say that that sometimes the scent varies between pod form and um bar form so hmm i definitely need to see how this is gonna work um, I don't think it should be an issue, but yeah, this is definitely sweeter than this. This is more spicy. This is more sweet. So, um, at some point I have to report back and let you guys know what my thoughts are on this one. So even though I don't have the warmer, I will show it to you because it really does look like it's going to be nice. So that's what it looks like. So all of you guys that are into your Halloween themes, your spooky themes, um, this is what it looks like. So clearly this has to be an element warmer. So let's read up and see what it is. So that's what it looks like there. And this is what it looks like off on the inside. And there you go. So let's see. Let me see what it says. Um, now, I need to go get the readers for this one. I was not about to struggle through a whole paragraph just to try and be halfway cute. Like, it is so not that serious. 
Okay, so here we go. And it says, scare up some fun. A ghostly trio haunts your home decor with an adorably eerie glow. So this is an element warmer. It is 7.5 inches tall. And the warmer will be $58.50. Uh, well, is $58.50. And it shows you where the wax goes on the inside. So the picture right here is showing you where the wax goes on the back. And then you see what it looks like off. And then what it looks like lit. So very cute. Very, very cute. I mean, it's just as fun off as it is on. So I like that. Very cute. So, like I said, if you're someone that's into, you know, decorating the whole house. Whew, felt like I had something on my lip. If you're someone that's into decorating the whole house in theme for Halloween or the whole month of September, whole month of October, then this would be a great option for you because this is really, really cute. It's not horribly big where you know it's gonna like take over the whole table and it's really nice so right now this is on sale for $58.50 the wax bar will be well is $5.40 the um pods are on sale for $9 instead of 10 and there is also a room spray, which we do not have um, in the box, that is $8.10. And it says new. There is a three, there is a scent circle three pack. So you can get three scent circles and they will be $9. So you can have all the things in this scent. And I love a scent circle. They are just great. You know, you can put it in your car to deodorize your car. It's not going to, it might last like a couple of weeks, but it's still a great way to refresh your car. And if you're somebody like me, I like my car. I like to smell different things when I get in it. So I don't want my car smelling like the same thing for like a month. Like I want to get in and smell different things. So a couple of weeks, week and a half, that's good enough for me. And then I can just switch out and move to something else. So that's it. Just wanted to come on and go over the scent of the month. Give me your thoughts if you have this yet. Give me your thought on the pods. Let me know if you think they're more spicier as well. And let me know how you are enjoying the wax. What are your thoughts is it a toss-up between Gimme Candy and this one? Give me your thoughts, and thanks so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.